Okay, so I'm starting my fish soup. I'm using for the first time my Instapot. I had my other pressure cooker, uh, electric pressure cooker, but this is uh, also works as a pressure cooker as well. And uh, a friend of mine told me he likes celery soup. Uh, this is just going to have some celery. It's really going to be a fish soup. And, uh, but I'm going to put plenty of celery. Uh, and so I'm going to overdo it because I'm going to pretend I'm cooking for him. Okay, so I cut up some extra celery. And it's all going in the pot. All of it's going to the, in the pot. I'm going to cut some carrots as well that I got from the Amish market today. And they are really lovely. Look at this. Look at these these carrots. Imagine that. Beautiful. Of course, I they, they didn't provide that little basket. I, I collect the baskets for refrigeration purposes when I, when I get the stuff. Because uh, I like it to be bagged up, but I want it to be breathing. I don't want it to be in plastic. So I'm going to cut up a few carrots as well, and I'll be right back. So I decided to use four carrots, and I'm going to cut them up now. And believe it or not, I'm putting leaf, mint leaves in it too. I'll be right back. And so now I'm going to cut a few pieces of fennel. And uh, this is going to really make it delicious. This is uh, a unique recipe. Uh, basically, I'm using whatever I have. Uh, but let me pour in the carrots while I'm at it. There we go. Doesn't that look beautiful? Okay, the fish started to go bad on me, but I washed it, washed off uh, the bad part, right? Like, sometimes it just starts to smell, and you wash it, and it smells good afterwards. So we're safe here. I've done it before, and usually the soup comes out so good that that it's like unbelievably good and and this fish soup i there's nothing i ever really ever made much of so i'm just cutting it into small pieces not a whole lot just to give it flavor okay um i think i'm going to do the uh peppers and onions tomorrow because i'm going to saute them so they get some flavor and uh one thing I am going to put, uh, that I really don't have to put right now, but I'm going to put some, okay, hold on, bok choy, this is so good for you, and it tastes really good in the soup, I really tried, uh, I tried bok choy the other day, uh, in another recipe, and it kind of like tastes bitter, I never knew it tastes bitter, but apparently, um, the, 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 the fish soup kind of like complements it. it. It just actually really tastes good, the, the bok choy. So I want to be right back. 